finally, G Crypto is here. Kung saan pwede ka makapag invest in cryptocurrency using GCash. Kaya sa video ito, I'm gonna show you exactly how you can create an account, tapos how you can top up your account, and how you can buy and sell cryptocurrency using GCash. So, yeah, let's go. So ngayon, I'm gonna show you how easy it is to create your G Crypto account. So basically, punta ka lang sa GCash account mo. So dati, nandito sila sa G Invest, and then makikita mo yung G Crypto. However, I don't know why, you just click itong View All option, tapos just scroll down below, makikita mo dito sa Enjoy part, nandito yung G Crypto. So I'm not sure bakit nandito to siya, but I believe dapat, dapat sana nandito siya sa G Grow eh, or sa G Invest. But basically, just look for G Crypto. Once you click yung G Crypto, basically, very simple lang talaga. Uh, yun nga, uh, welcome to G Crypto na, and then let's get started. Click mo itong Get Started button, and then basically, si, si G Crypto will ask your information from your GCash account. Kasi meron ka ng account in GCash, di ba? And by the way, very important, dapat verify din yung GCash account mo. Kasi they're gonna extract yung, yung, yung information mo, like ito yung GCash num number mo, yung birthday, and so on and so forth. After that one, you just click yung I agree. And then may mga additional questions lang. So this is, I believe, for ano tawag nito, uh, anti-money laundering law, something like that. So just say dito like, are you currently involved, exposed to politics, no... U.S. citizen, no, and then what is your gender, male? And then, ito, my questions about your investment experience. If familiar ka ba with cryptocurrencies? After that one, ayun na, uh, just check ito for the terms and conditions. Uh, you can review yung mga terms and conditions, but normally, we just click, I agree, di ba? And then, once you once you click this one, go to G Crypto. boom, my G Crypto account ka na. So, that's how easy it is to create an account in G crypto. So once my account can basically you just have to top up your trading wallet. So trading wallet basically this is like yung cash mo inside G crypto. So itong cash na to you can this is now what you can use to buy and sell cryptocurrency. So the good thing is again it is so easy then to top up your account. However, before that, let me show you yung mga cryptocurrencies inside G crypto. So uh ito yon. So medyo madami din. There are more than 20 uh cryptocurrencies. So you can see dito Bitcoin, USDC, Solana, I believe nandito din ito, BNB. Kasi I also do play-to-earn games. So BNB, perfect. Meron siyang BNB. AADA or Cardano. Uh, ano pa ba? Matic. Uh, Axie Infinity. Tapos sa uh, Engine and SLP. So majority ng mga gaming tokens nandito. So I'm actually very happy for G Crypto. Kasi marami silang mga options uh, to buy cryptocurrency. So ngayon, let's top up our account. Very simple, very easy. Again, just click yung top up button. So, nandito yan. Top up your trading wallet. And after that one, just input any amount. And then, uh, amount, convenience fee, total amount. Then, just click continue. And then, after that one, you're about to pay from your GCash account. So, again, from your GCash account, papunta sa G Crypto account. And then, click pay. And then, boom. It's as simple as that. It's like, para ka lang nag-bills nag payment. And may, may merong laman na yung G Crypto account mo. So after that one, once may laman na, meron ka ng trading wallet. So dito you can top up or withdraw. And now pwede na tayong bumili ng cryptocurrency. So ngayon, let me show you how you can buy and sell cryptocurrency using your G Crypto. So basically, just click itong buy button or itong see more option. Tapos dito mo makikita lahat ng mga cryptocurrencies that you might want to invest in. And in this video, let me show you how you can buy, let's say for example, Binance Coin or BNB. And tapos makikita mo dito na you can actually send and receive cryptocurrency dito sa Gcrypto. Meaning, if you click itong receive button, makikita mo na meron kang tinatawag na wallet address. So itong wallet address, this is basically like a string of letters and numbers. Tapos ito yung gagamitin mo if you wanna receive or send cryptocurrency. So why is this relevant? Kasi let's say for example, meron kang account in like other exchanges like crypto, crypto.com, meron kang account in Binance or whatever. So you can actually send and receive cryptocurrency. So this is very powerful kasi si Maya, Walang option pa nito to receive and to send and receive as of now. Tapos si coins.ph naman meron silang wallet. So I'm very happy na si G Crypto, you can also uh, receive, send and receive cryptocurrency. So basically, ayun nga, it's a string of numbers or basically a QR code. So pwede ka lang mag-scan and you can now send cryptocurrency uh, using uh, using itong G Crypto. And take note also in BNB, meron kasi mga iba-ibang chains. So like, ito naman, this is like in the Binance Smart Chain. Merong Bitcoin Chain, merong Ethereum Chain. So make sure you take note of this, um, take note of this chain. So you cannot send 
if uh, you cannot send Binance coin to an Ethereum wallet. So, hindi pwede yun. So, dapat Binance to Binance, BSC o to BSC. Anyway, I probably create a separate video for that one. And also, take note also na itong, itong wallet mo, this is a centralized wallet. Meaning, in case something happens to G Crypto, wala kang control. Wala kang control with your own cryptocurrency. So, that's why meron din tinatawag na mga decentralized wallet. However, that's uh, beyond the scope of this video. So, I just put a link top right of this video if you want to learn more about decentralized na mga wallet. So, yeah, this is if you want to receive. However, if you want to send naman, so just click this uh, send button and makikita mo na dito you can send the amount of BN, BNB that you can send. Uh, you want to send. Dito naman yung, yung, yung wallet address or pwede ka lang mag-scan ng QR code sa wallet address. Again, make sure na if you're gonna send BNB, dapat BNB din yung uh, marireceive uh, yung, yung wallet address niya. Or else, mawawala yung cryptocurrency mo. Tapos dito, take note also na minimum amount to send is this one, 0 0.001. Tapos meron din maximum amount to send. And meron silang tinatawag na network fee. Or basically, uh, ito yung tinatawag na gas fee. So this is how you can send uh, send or receive cryptocurrency. And also, in terms naman of buying and selling, makikita mo dito na merong different prices. So, ito yung price if you wanna buy BNB. Ito naman yung price if you wanna sell BNB. So, makikita mo na if you wanna buy, medyo mahal siya. And if you wanna sell, medyo mura siya. So, just like foreign exchange, meron siyang tinatawag na spread. Dito kumikita si Crypto. So, bibili ka ng mas mahal if you wanna sell, uh, mas mura yung bentahan. So, yung difference, yan yung spread, dan kumikita si Crypto. So, ngayon, let's, let me show you if you wanna buy uh, Binance coin. So basically, just click itong buy button. After that one, uh, dito makikita mo yung minimum amount. Minimum amount to buy. So 0 0.002. So for testing purposes, yan yung gusto natin. So 0 0.002. And then yung yung price nun is just 37 pesos. So just imagine, 37 pesos pwede kang bumili ng Binance coin. And after that one, um, just scroll down below. Click mo yung buy button, waiting. And then, boom! That's how easy it is to buy cryptocurrency using G Crypto. So after you buy, uh, basically meron ka ng balance ito. And now you can, that's how you buy G Crypto. And if you wanna sell naman, just same thing, just click itong sell button, sell the amount, and makikita mo na kaagad, uh, mabibenta mo na siya kaagad. And then once mabenta mo na siya, uh, mapupunta na siya sa trading wallet mo. So once nandun na sa trading wallet, you can actually withdraw from your G Crypto account to your G Cash account. So yeah, that is it. That is how simple and easy it is to use G Crypto. So I hope you find this video valuable and helpful. And if you did, make sure to smash that like button for the YouTube algorithm. Tapos support me by subscribing para mahit natin itong silver play button and we can reach more Filipinos. And if you want to start your Lodi lifestyle journey with me, visit my website freedomlabph.com. Again, that's freedomlabph.com. I hope to see you inside. Once again, Tio Pilo here. And yung goal natin is to live on dividends and interest. Bye-bye!